You are watching a master at work. I'm going to be showing you the absolute easiest and newest car to car merge glitch on GTA 5 Online. Consider subscribing if you'd like to help the channel grow. Drop a big fat like on the video and let's get right on into it. Sadly, this variation of the glitch requires you to have a third friend, and that third friend doesn't have to do anything at all. Just pull out a car and sit right there in the session. However, on the plus side, this glitch does not require you to get yourself glitched out in any way, shape, or form, so it's easy as can be. Let's begin. Load into an invite-only session with a friend and then a second friend as well. You're going to have your second friend to call out his ramp buggy, and he's going to park it exactly right here on the map. Once you get to this location, you're going to have him to back it up right here in this little crevice against these concrete pillars. He can also back it all the way up on top of the pillars if he'd like to do so and give you a little bit higher of an angle. From there, he's going to exit out of the vehicle and stand off nearby, and he can go completely AFK. If he does go AFK, tell him to have his stick set at an angle. That way his character is moving in a circle and he doesn't get kicked out. Now, you and your other friend are going to have to position your yachts in a certain way. So both of you are going to go to your individual yachts, you're going to go up to the captain's quarters, you're going to speak with him, and you're going to ask to move the ship. Have your friend to move his ship first to the location called Terminal, and once he does, you're then going to move your ship to the Terminal location as well. Each ship location has a secondary location, and you're going to want your ship to be in that secondary location, which is going to be positioned directly out from your friend's ramp buggy car that's parked at the docks. And this is exactly what you want. Now that we have all those things set up and in position, we need to set up the vehicle that we're going to put all the modifications onto. While you're standing on the yacht, go ahead and call your captain and choose the option to request personal vehicle. Once you select that option, whatever garage is on the top of that list, that's where you're going to place the vehicle that you want all the modifications put onto. You're going to place it in the number one parking space of that garage. This is extremely important and you'll see why a little bit later on. At this point, I'm going to purchase the newest vehicle and I'm going to place it in the number one parking spot of the garage that's on the top of the list. From here, you want to call out a relatively fast car that has plenty of modifications onto it that you would like to merge onto the other vehicle. At that point, tell your friend to call out a vehicle as well, and you're going to meet him at the Los Santos Car Meet location. With both you and your friend inside of the Car Meet location with your cars, you're going to open your interaction menu, you'll go to LS Car Meet, go down to Sprint, and select that option. It's going to send your friend an invite to a Sprint race. Tell him to open up his phone and accept that invite. The sprint race is going to start up. After the 3, 2, 1 countdown, you're going to hold triangle for a couple of seconds and that's going to respawn your vehicle. At this point, your other friend's just going to wait right there and you're going to make your way down to the docks to where that ramp buggy is parked. Once you're at the docks, you're going to open up your phone, you're going to call your captain, and you're going to highlight the option to request the personal vehicle. With that option on screen, you're going to drive all the way down this straightaway, all the way to the end, and then you're going to turn around and we're going to go full speed and hit the ramp buggy and launch out into the ocean out toward your yacht. And and once you start to get close by your yacht, you're going to begin rapidly pressing the X button to select the option to request a personal vehicle. If it doesn't give you the option to do so, that means you landed too short. You're going to try again. Continue trying until you've gotten close enough to the yacht to where you're landing in the water and it's giving you the option to select that personal vehicle and you're rapidly pressing the X button on that option. It may take you a couple of tries to actually hit it. It did for me as well. But once you hit it, you're going to spawn inside of that vehicle and it's going to be completely modified with all those modifications. Now that you've done this, you can tell your friend that's in the sprint race to go ahead and leave out of the session. From here, you're going to take this car to Los Santos Car Meet or Los Santos Customs and make a change to the vehicle. A single change, it doesn't matter what it is. Now that we've done this, we've completely modified, merged, and saved this vehicle. I appreciate you all for tuning in and I appreciate all the continued support. Consider subscribing if you'd like to help the channel grow. Drop a big fat like on the video and let me know you did in the comments below. It's ya boy, Jay Stone, and I'm gone. Subscribe on Daddy's channel.